I now give the floor to the United Nations Watch. Mr. Chairman, despite the efforts of the international community, Daniel Ortega continues to commit severe human rights violations that surpass even those suffered during the civil conflicts of the past. This is a painful reality to witness. Urgent action is necessary to bring an end to these atrocities. Despite the difference among Nicaraguans, all factions involved in the conflicts of the past had, to some extent, respected the practice of our faith. Throughout our history, Catholic universities, churches, and institutions of various Christian denominations have played key roles as humanitarian centers. Therefore, engaging not only in extrajudicial killings, but also in the closure of universities like the Central American University, UCA, and depriving over a million Nicaraguans of the humanitarian services offered by more than 3,000 civic organizations represents an inhumane act of great proportions. I will not enumerate the violations documented in the High Commissioner's report. What remains questionable, Mr. Chairman, is the ongoing occurrence of these violations exemplified by the arbitrary imprisonment of Bishop Rolando Alvarez and over 80 other innocent individuals with no repercussions for Ortega. When will this council take decisive action? We eagerly await your response. Thank you. Thank you.